quickly. The, the problem is, the minute I heard that loads of stupid, reactionary, clueless fuckwits were stockpiling fucking bog roll, my first thought was, stupid, reactionary, clueless fuckwits. And my second thought was, must buy loo roll. Lots of it. That's humanity in a nutshell, isn't it? The human race, collectively, we are thick as shit. And as individuals, we are selfish and thick as shit. We're, we're sort of seeing the measure of people a bit here, aren't we? We're, we're about to see the, the best and the very worst of humanity under the microscope. Like, we're the ones in the Petri dish. As the consequences of this pandemic begin to sink in, that everyone is going to be affected in some way. It's not the disease we should be scared of, but it's what it exposes. How thin the veneer is, how little control we have, how inept and frail our governments are, how our entire so-called civilization is a facade, how our global economy is merely a smokescreen for mass inequality and an inherent hierarchy where the rich are protected and the poor and vulnerable aren't. How close so many people are to the poverty line and the fringes of society without even knowing it. Look at what's happening. We are at a tiny moment in human history where the elderly and the sick are in acute danger of losing their lives and millions of others without job security who are just one or two paychecks away from destitution are in acute danger of losing their incomes, their jobs, their homes. And the only people we can really look to for help and advice are our leaders who we would hope are looking to scientists and experts to guide them. And yet... Half our world leaders have already caught the fucking thing, and the leader of the free world is, as ever, making it up as he goes along, relying on instinct and his own self-styled, stable genius rather than the advice of experts. Usually, when a president addresses the nation from the Oval Office, it is to calm fears, steady the ship, clarify the facts, and alleviate confusion. Donald Trump, he likes to do things differently. He's a bit of a maverick like that. So even when reading from a carefully prepared script, albeit in the manner of a dyslexic blancmange being forced to read the eulogy of someone he's never met after having taken a huge line of cocaine, but even with a script, he manages to say the opposite of what he means, contradict what he said only 24 hours earlier, i.e., actual quote, just stay calm, it will go away. Stoke fear, confuse the fuck out of everyone, insult and blame the whole thing on his allies, this foreign virus, and in trying to calm the markets, he manages to make them tank even further by implementing a containment policy that everyone on the planet knows will have no material effect whatsoever. And then he tops it off by suggesting the US has the most advanced healthcare in the world. Well, yeah, if you're fucking loaded. Whereas the truth is, this virus is about to expose the horror of the US health system in all its glory. Get ill and go bankrupt. It's the American dream, isn't it? But it's not just America, is it? That's the problem. The truth is this virus will create more bankruptcies than it will deaths across the globe. Yes, thousands of people are jumping for joy as they realise they can do their job from the comfort of their own sofa whilst watching Netflix. But not everyone has a job that allows them to do that. Not everyone can afford to self-isolate for 14 days. It's fine if you're some middle-class twat in the media who can happily lock themselves away in the comfort of their own loft apartment for two weeks, passing the time by wanking to Mumford and Sons. Not so great if you're on a zero-hour contract as a cleaner or a bar tender or whatever, in which case, government advice is to default on your rent and use a fucking food bank. This is a real them and us moment, and only the well and the well-off will survive. Survival of the richest. 14 days of self-isolation. I'd love it. There's going to be a lot of wanking going on. Hence all the loo roll.